Hi everyone, this is Andrea and welcome back to my channel. And today I look messy because I feel a little bit sick, but I I, I feel better now. And aside from that, today is a very special day for me because it is my second year of taking hormones. <laughs> it's really it's been amazing. It's been a journey for me. It's it's really hard. I'm not complaining, but it is. Um, for a fact that hormones has its side effects, and I always get headaches, I always get sleepy and mood swings. I struggle a lot from taking it. And not to mention its price, the regular um, doctor's consultation, it's really expensive but it's my life goal and this is what I want to do this is the life I chose and I'm happy I did and today to celebrate my second year of HRT I decided to make a timeline video or a montage for you guys um, this has been your request so I decided to do it on my second year <laughs> I would want to warn you guys that you will not look at me the same way again you will not think of me the same way again because you will see how I look like before when I was still a guy and when I was still masculine and it's really um it's been a journey for me but I don't care because this video is to inspire my transgender friends all over the world or all the transgender people all over the world and I hope that as much as possible every transgender women or men or people all over the world will have the chance to watch this video and I would want to say and I would like to say that if you can imagine it you can do it it could happen just don't give up don't lose hope just be yourself <sighs> so let's get started um, this is for every one of you and I don't really want to stop this is only the beginning and if I can make thousands and thousands of videos I would do that to inspire people and I hope I inspire you the pictures that you can see are from the year 2011. I always thought that I'm the ugliest person in the world. I always thought that this is not me. I'm, I'm in the wrong body. My skin is so rough. I always get pimples. I have muscles. I hate how I look like before. At that time, I looked so masculine and not passable at all. I always get bullied everywhere. It was really hard for me, but I did not give up. In 2012, I started working in the call center industry. I love it because here there is no any discrimination. You can be who you really want to be. And by then, I started wearing more makeup, wear the clothes I want, and even grow my hair. I'm happy I chose to work here. Obviously, in the pictures that you see, I try so hard to look like a girl. I try so hard to pass. But that's what I think of. That's what I want to be. And that's what I consider myself as. 
I set myself free. And by then, I started to transition. The pictures that you can see at this moment is in the mid-2012 when I started to take hormones. I can still remember the first hormone pill that I took. I felt so happy. It felt so fulfilling. And by then, I took it regularly. I didn't stop until I get the desired effects that I wanted to get. I even bought hair extensions because I was so excited to grow my hair and to look more feminine. I even bought a lot of girls' clothes and learned women's fashion. I gained confidence. It is so ironic to say that the people who were bullying me before are the people who give me compliments today. And even the guys, I get decent proposals. It's really funny. I forgive them, of course. It felt so satisfying. It boosts my confidence. They say I'm turning into a beautiful girl. I want to hear it over and over. I don't stop taking hormones. I take it regularly. I visit my doctor from time to time because I want to take care of my health and turn into a beautiful woman at the same time. And now that I'm taking it for two years, it's only the beginning because I know I'll be taking this forever. Don't give up, just be yourself. And that's it. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you like it. Just before I end this video, I would like to tell all the transgender people all over the world that if you haven't started your transition or maybe you just took your first ever hormone pill today, don't lose hope, don't give up, don't stop. That's why it's called transition. It has stages and you have to be patient. Please subscribe, like, and if you have comments, put it down below. Thank you guys for watching.